Hello everyone, Teen Gamer here, and I'm joined by Teen Gamer, and this is um Anime Bento. Bento May. Yeah, May. May. The May unboxing. The reason we're a bit late with this upload is they were having some kind of customs issues. They seem to have it. Scissor. You can open the scissors. Revolutionary <laughs> technology. Okay. Well, what scissors when you have hands? Okay, can I, um... Oh, wow. Once again... <laughs> well, I oh, guess... Oh, let's hope we do... Oh, stuff's falling out. Okay, okay well, uh, let's... Yeah. <laughs> let's put this to the side. We don't want to know what we got yet. How about you do the shirt? Okay, oh, I see some candy. Let's, let's hope it's not sweet potatoes. Okay, so this shirt is Como Suki Silhouette. And it looks cool. I'll have to look it up real quick. It's an extra large. Why don't you show them the gum can? That looks like the sweet stuff. Please no. I am going to try it. It's a Pokemon chew. I think it's gum. But here's the shirt. I am going so to try I'm gonna, a piece. I'm going to look up what the shirt is. And give you guys a little overview of it. What color do you think I should do? Just take one. It doesn't matter which one. What is it? Oh, I forgot a U. That might help. Okay. So. Toast monsters. Let me see if I can. Uh, <laughs> We're trying find over the end. It is disgusting. So this is the box. Has seemed fairly good, except for the stuff. Oh, I accidentally this dropped. This is learned. That job is nasty. Uh, well, I, I found a government website. I don't think that's what this anime is. Uh. Why don't you uh, open? You on? <laughs> Here we go again. Oh, the memories. Why is it double wrapped? Okay, I'm going to open this little box here. Something from ReZero. Oh boy. Yeah, it's a Pokemon shoe. Thing looks like tape. <laughs> it's disgusting. It's a piece of wood. I chew really well, huh? <laughs> it's stuck. <laughs> okay. Well then. Oh, there's the taste. <laughs> I need to use my scissors. My scissors. The tape is very bad. Very bad. Very bad. It's like sour. Sour pop. You want to take out the next thing? I'm trying to figure out what a komusuki is. Kama suki. Oh, something happened. That's probably the storm outside. Toastmasters komusuki. Okay. okay, so. Kama Suki. Uh, D. D. Gray Man is what it's from. I think. Maybe. Okay, so I'm gonna use this opportunity to tell you guys about D. Gray Man because that's what it seems like it's from. So let me just look up D. Gray Man. Oh! And if that's I love not the right one. thing, I apologize. I taught you the wrong thing. At least you learned something. So this one right here is Pocleo and it is um Sog Sogalio. Gray. <laughs> Sorry Japan if I'm mispronouncing y'all's gum or the gum name. Sorry. The gum's mm -hmm. nasty. Can that even be classified as gum? Okay. So now I'm gonna tell you what I think. I think this is D Gray Man because that's a character called Kamasuki. I couldn't find anything else Chom Chomsuke. 
anything else, yeah. So, okay. It is a Japanese manga series written and illustrated by that... Oh. Kam... Kabarmio? Oh, uh, well, uh, why don't we stop trying to do Pokemon names, take out the next thing. I'm doing this thing, so... Okay. So, he joins an organization of exorcists named the Black Order. They use ancient substance, innocence. Is, is it really that ancient? Is innocence really that ancient? I mean, there's innocence and guilty. I, I guess. To combat man as the Millennium Earl. Who names their child Millennium Earl? And his demonic army of Akuma. Akuma. Hey, that's that character from Street Fighter. He must be the devil or something. Uh, who intend to destroy humanity. Many characters are adapted from his previous works, such as Zone. The series is noted for its dark narrative. So it seems kind of like a grim. Oh, it's... It's been in the Weekly Shonen. That's a pretty big uh, manga thing. Yeah. Shonen also does some anime <laughs> dubs and such. The series in, on different hiatus, it resumes serialization. Okay, so it, it keeps coming back and going off and coming back. Eh, 22.5 million copies sold. It's a pretty successful show. So show the guy, he has a, uni he has a uniform horn. It's about exorcist. Open the next thing. Okay, so now I'm going to look up ReZero. I think I've looked that one up before. Let's see what we got. Ooh. Someone's just not right about this character. <laughs> Someone's just not right. Oh! Oh! It even comes. It's a metal. It even flops out. Okay, so. Look up the gum next. No, no, the gum is Pokemon, shoot. We don't need to look it up. It's Pokemon. I mean, you, you throw a Pokeball at it, you catch it. It's yours. You battle it. And I'm going to open up the next thing. Uh, no, that's not right. Okay, so I'm just going to look up one of the ReZeros. Hope it's the right one. Okay, so it's a light novel series. The story centers on... Subaru Nakatashi, who suddenly finds himself transported to another world on his way home from a convenience store. The series was initially serialized on a website. Eleven volumes have been published in Media Factory. Series first five arcs. I wonder which arc this character's from. If there's like, if the first five, that implies there's more after the first five, so that would mean that I'm looking at the sixth. Oh, wait a minute. These are like little okay, Pokemon so card thingies. It's still running. It started April 20th to 2012. The only one that doesn't have the number is the one with Popplio and Sogaleo. Oh, and if we have any misinformation, don't blame us. Blame Wikipedia. That's the only place I can find the information. Or blame Japan. No, nah, blame Wikipedia. And then we have... You should know. Uh, yeah, it's the moon. Okay, yeah. so... This is about on way home school transport. Let's see, what's this thing? Oh, that went well. This is a Bungo Stray Dog Rubber Charm. So I'm just gonna look up Bungo Stray Dogs. I'm probably gonna find some video. On my the, the tablet keeps falling. I'd like it to stay up. Oh, there it is. I found Bungo Stray Dogs. Okay, it's a Japanese manga series written by Kafalaka Asuragi and illustrated by Sangu Harukawa, which is serialized in the magazine Young Ace since 2012. An anime television series adaptation by Bones aired in 2016 in two parts. The first part aired between 7, between 7 April 2016 and 23 June 26. I think there's some kind of translation error. Uh, okay, so an anime film is going to be quarter Ooh, to 2018. So it shows like on the side which one she can get, but we got this weird one with the little okay. um, hatchet maybe. Finally worth the plot. That was a long intro. 
The story centers around individuals who are gifted with supernatural powers and use them for different purposes, including holding a business, solving mysteries, carrying out missions. I sign okay, so they're they're Superman Mafia. So, uh, let's see, is this the final thing that we have to look up? So this yep. is this is Mafia. That's Monster World. That's Pokemon. If you need an explanation, just look at look up Pokemon, on. I mean. Yeah. We have that and that one's really confusing. Oh, can I show you some? So, oh. It oh is it like a bottle cap opener? <laughs> yeah. I'm... No, no, oh no, it's a metal book marker. Okay, Yuri on Ice. I believe we've actually had something from Yuri on Ice, so I'm just gonna refresh my memory. Yuki on Ice. Yuri. Yuri on Ice. It's not a K, it's an R, I know the spelling's a bit confusing. And uh, Japan don't okay. send us. Sorry. It's about figure skating. Thank you. Uh, okay, Yuri on Ice is way discussion concerning. Oh. Well, this is not a show that's safe for families or any of the younger audiences. It has depictions of same-sex relationships between its protagonists, some critics praising it for it, and others criticizing it for it. We are not going to say anything, so we're not trying to offend anyone right now. But I hope you all learned something. I want to thank everyone for watching and say... Hope you have a wonderful day!